I'm going to get my hair cut. So I thought I would uh, bring you guys along. Uh, I've never been to this place before. It's actually my, one of my really good friend's sisters. Um, and uh, yeah, so I'm not sure what she's gonna have there in terms of accessibility. I know I can get in there. Um, and my friend's in a wheelchair, so I know that she's like used to that. Oh, there's Jamie. Jamie's coming with me. So we're gonna, yeah, go get her hair cut and I'll show you how I transfer and things like that. So this is a new place for me, so <laughs> we'll see how it goes. We have like a 36 minute drive and I think we're gonna be on time. Hopefully the roads are good. And then you might have to help me up this bump. Not a pop up? Yeah. Oh. Good? Yeah. No jumping. I'm like excited. I like, They're not. That's how we say hi. Is it bumped to the back of the chair? Yeah. Jamie got her hair cut first, and this was the first time that she got a real salon wash, so she was super pumped about it. She felt like a little lady. While Jamie was getting her hair cut, I was busy cuddling the cutest puppies ever. This one was so sweet and quiet, and that one was very jumpy and loud. Jamie had to stand up to get her hair cut for a little while because her back wasn't high enough when she was sitting on the salon chair. She hopped back in it and then got her front cut and then had a nice blow dry. And then the stylist used this cool little technique to make her hair look all voluminous and poofy at the end. Jamie loved it. You love it? Huh? Can we get chicken on the way home? Maybe. Look at that, it's all your hair. Look at this thing coming on the floor. Oh my god, Reggie. He's like done? He's done. He made, like, we thought Wendy was fast. He made Wendy look like Wendy was fast. He's like fuzz and remember, he has to leave fuzz for my coat. Like, what is that? After Jamie was done, it was my turn. I transferred onto the chair to get my hair washed. And for years, I used to make my husband come to the salon with me because I was too intimidated to do these transfers. And then I started doing the transfers when he was around so that I got confident enough to do it and eventually started going on my own and just kind of figured that if I needed help, the stylist or whoever was there would help me. And that's what happened a couple times until I got good at it. And every time I go to a new stylist, there's always that like little bit of nerves before I figure out uh, whether I'll be able to do the transfers, but it usually works out. All right, now we gotta go get in the other chair game. Oh, this one doesn't have arms. Nope. Yeah, this one's way better. Because the one, the ones of the other salon, I, I would transfer on the front and use the arm because mm. but this one's okay because it doesn't have an arm. Sweet. I got it for you guys and uh, my buddies. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> A very accessible salon chair. <laughs> it doesn't have an arm. Normally salon chairs are really awkward to transfer onto because they have armrests on either side and you can't get close enough to the front because there's a footrest there. So I was pleasantly surprised to see that this one didn't have arms on the side so I could pull right up to it and transfer. Jamie didn't do as good a job recording my haircut as I did recording hers. So she actually didn't get any footage of my hair being cut when it was wet. She just got this little clip of my hair being cut when it was dry, but that's okay. <laughs> and that's it. That was really fast. Yeah. I'm impressed. Do you know like what brand of chair this is? I'm gonna put this in like the I, I old. I think oh. it's from the 80s. Oh, okay, it's like <laughs> never mind. There's no brand, but whatever chair doesn't have arms is like yeah. more wheelchair accessible. So if there's a salon watching this, yes, uh, get one that doesn't have arms. I looked it up and could not find this chair anywhere. Nor could I find any that didn't have arms. So that sucks. Hide style lotus. Hide style lotus. Side style chair. H Y D. H Y D. Okay. I'm gonna look that up. That sticker is like in pristine condition. That's it. We're done.